What's good, everybody, and welcome back to The Producer's Life. I'm your man, Big Boy Track, and welcome back to another beat making video. Today, we're doing a DJ Toon slash TI type of beat. This was actually requested by somebody in the comments about a couple months ago, and they requested it again. 2005 DJ Toon inspired type of trap beat with the victory type of vibe. So I want y'all to sit back and relax, and I hope y'all enjoy this beat making video. Let's go. Just getting a basic little drum groove going. All right, so now that we got a little basic drum pattern going without the kick, I'm gonna go ahead and start doing the melody and lay down some chords, so let's do this. So next I'm about to add in the brass to bring some low end to this beat. I may have the bass line follow this brass, but I'm not sure yet because I may use 808s, but let's go ahead and record that in there. Next, I'm about to throw in like a choir. I don't know if y'all remember and what you know about that, the tomb did for T.I. He had like this choir in there. And I don't know, man, the choir just added like this dope vibe to the track. So I'm thinking it's gonna sound just as good in this beat. So let's go ahead and give it a try. If it don't sound good, we can just straight up take it out. So let's go. Next, I'm about to add in some staccato strings. These were pretty popular back in a lot of the trap beats back then. So let's go ahead and throw that in there real quick. That, that that last part was messed up. Hold on, let me fix that last part. All right, let me do let me do the cheap way, y'all. Let's go ahead and chop and edit that so I ain't gotta replay it or go in there and try to fix it. That sound hard. The next instrument I'm about to go ahead and throw in a synthesized lead. And the lead will follow that lower register brass just a little bit, but it's gonna have slight variations, so it's not gonna follow it all the way through. You know what I'm saying? So let me go ahead and show y'all what I'm talking about. Let's go.
All right, y'all, so let's go ahead and throw the kick drum in there because it's definitely lacking. After I do the kick drum, I'm going to do the bass line. Finally, we're about to go ahead and add in this bass line to bring this track alive. So let's go ahead and record that in there real quick. So for the last instrument, I'm about to add in a string. But what I'm gonna do is instead of playing it, I'm gonna go ahead and just copy and paste the synthesized lead because it's gonna follow the same pattern. But what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and alter some of the notes in there because I don't want it to uh, be as high up in the registration with the uh, string. So I'm gonna bring them down a couple notches. So I'm gonna show you what I'm talking about. Let's go. So let's go ahead and copy and paste that. See how high that is in the register? So I'm gonna just I'm gonna probably bring that down some. And I might have to bring that down completely to a whole different. Hold on, let me turn that on. Snap. There we go. So basically the beat is done. And what I'm about to do now is go ahead and track out the drums out of machine. And then we're gonna start and get this arranged so y'all can hear what the possible finish track gonna sound like. Let's do this. All right, y'all, so that wraps up the beat making video. I hope y'all enjoyed that. Um, I try to make it as close to DJ Toom as possible. As you can tell, I took some inspiration from what you know about that, uh, which he produced for TI. DJ Toom is so versatile, none of his beats sound alike. A lot of his beats, some of them have like a signature sound in them, but for the most part, he's super versatile. Every beat, he switches it up, man. So it's kind of hard to really lock down a DJ Toom type of beat, man. But I gave him my best shot. I think it came out dope, man. Y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comments below. If you have not already subscribed, make sure you go ahead and subscribe. I will be coming back with another beat making video real soon. I hope y'all enjoyed this, and I want to thank everybody for kicking with your man Big Boy Tracks right here at the Producers Life. And I'll see y'all next time. Peace.